My family always had concerns and they always talked to me about it, um, but I simply ignored it um, because I was stuck in, in the drug of food. As a child growing up, uh, mainly uh, food was like my sense of pleasure. Uh, I went to it ever since I was a kid. Uh, food was like my way of uh, getting out of things if I got in trouble or um, if uh, something happened in the family and I got depressed. Food was my go-to. And as the years progressed, as I got older and older, uh, more and more food just became my drug of choice, more or less. And um, I took it uh, beyond what it should have been. You know, a lot of people have certain drug addictions, you know, and mine was food. And, and that's what I loved, you know, food was it. It was, it was my life. It, it controlled me. It told me what to do. It was like the nail in the coffin. It was like I, I got to do something. So then that's when I looked up for the bariatric surgery. Um, I did my research for about a year uh, until I decided to go with Dr. Siddiqui. The reason I love Dr. Siddiqui is because he's very strict and adamant about what he does and he's sincere about your well-being. Um, I've never met a doctor like him. Uh, he is, the thing I, I love about him is he's strict about what he wants done in order for you to have this surgery. And it makes you follow the program because if you don't follow the program, then he won't do the surgery. There are several options in surgeries that you can get. I chose the gastric sleeve for the fact of the matter, not only, it, it's only a helping tool. And I didn't want to do something to where I didn't have to do less I wanted to do more to prove myself. Um, with the gastric sleeve, you not only have to watch what you eat, you also have to exercise and make it work. To get to the goal weight that I am at now, it took me only one year. And that comes with a lot of pain and heartache and struggle like I said, you have to work at it. You have to maintain your eating habits. Um, exercise is absolutely a must. You've got to exercise. Uh, to peel off what I did in a year is astronomical. It's amazing. Basically, right now, I feel like I'm 19 again. You know, uh, feel very young, uh, even though I'm 41. Uh, very young, very active. Uh, now I'm up to jogging two miles without losing my breath. Um, also, I, my exercise routine on a daily basis is, I would have never ever thought that I would ever be exercising every day, but I do. Um, my eating habits have changed tremendously. I made a promise to a friend of mine uh, before the surgery. Um, his name is Derek Holloway. Uh, rest in peace, my friend. Um, he uh, was a contributing factor and died of obesity. Um, the promise I made to him was that I would never be like him and I would change it for him. And you know, I promised that for him and I stick to my promises. When I keep a promise, I stick with them. And this is for him 
not only my family and my daughter and my grandson, but mainly for him to prove to him. And I know he's watching over me today because he's here with me right now, um, you know, smiling, saying, awesome job, Chuck. Thank you.